All right, guys, we got something special today. I know I usually try to keep this channel fairly cheap, but I have a rifle on loan from a buddy of mine, and I cannot help but put it on this channel because the thing is super cool. Check this out. It is a 300 PRC. Oh yeah. This thing is carbon fiber barrel wrapped. Muzzle brake. Come over here and check out this muzzle brake. Now this is actually a Christensen Arms rifle. It is a very, very nice rifle. Um, extremely lightweight. I mean, I think it will come weighs in at six pounds. Extremely lightweight for this heavy of a caliber. It'll be very interesting to see how hard this thing recoils. What kind of uh, groups we're gonna have with it. And we got something set up down to 200. We got a jug of water. We're gonna blow that up. And we kind of put a watermelon down there too. So that should be fun. This thing has an, a really nice recoil pad. See that? It does have a bunch of give which I imagine it's going to need it. The bolt on this, fluted. Dual lug, very nice. Um, this is a Remington footprint action, it looks like, with a few upgrades. It's almost kind of has a Bagheera feel to it with the bolt release here. Very nice. That is a really, really nice feature of this rifle. Underneath it, check that out. I love when they put the floor plates like this. And check out this trigger, guys. A really nice trigger. It has a really clean break, really crisp pull. You really can't ask for anything better. I'm not sure what kind of trigger that they put in the Christensen Arms, but man, it is good. It has very little creep and it just pops. Overall, this rifle is extremely well made. Out of the stock, it's all pillar bedded. It's a really well made rifle. Let's hope it shoots that way. Um, this is what it shoots. 225 grain ELD match bullet is what this one is. Um, if you don't know much about the 300 PRC, this is my first rodeo with it as well. But it is a Ruger 375 case that they have chopped and necked down. This thing is massive. Should be fun to shoot. Should be extremely fun when it hits something to see what happens. Um, well, let's get done with this. Let's shoot some groups first. Remember, this rifle is on loan to me. I have not even shot this rifle yet, so it should be fun to see exactly what kind of accuracy I can get with it. And maybe at the end of it, we're gonna throw in what it shoots like without the break, because I'm betting it makes a big difference. All right, guys, let's get to this. 100 yards, 300 Christensen Arms PRC. This thing is a hoss. The bolt slide with that is just exceptional. It's phenomenal how smooth and crisp that is and then when you slide it down. All right, last shot. Oh. To nobody's surprise, that thing is an excellent shooter. Look at this, guys. We got two bullet holes touching and one off to the side. This one I could have pulled, I'm not 100% sure, because this was actually my very first shot that I shot, I think. We'll have to rerun the camera just to make sure, but it shoots really well. But now, let's go stick something down to 200 yards and watch it explode. I brought a watermelon and a water jug, so let's do that.
<laughs> well, you guys ever shot a 300 PRC? If so, what kind? It'd just be really cool to see what kind y'all shoot. What's like the best powder? Cause I might get into loading for one of these things. And what kind of bullet do you guys find works the best? Comment below, that'd be cool to know. All right, we took off this brake. Check that out, that thing's sweet. Um, here's what it was like me shooting with the brake. And now I'm gonna shoot it without the brake. Let's see if this thing has a much heavier recoil, how much that brake actually helps. That recoil is about twice as hard without the brake on it. That's crazy how much this can affect how much felt recoil. There's nothing left of this watermelon. We got a couple of pieces and some watermelon guts randomly sprayed everywhere. On our walk down here, check out what I found. An empty 308 case. Just for a size comparison, because everybody knows what 308 looks like. Look how much difference. Yeah, the 300 PRC means business. And shooting it without that brake one time, whoa. Yeah, you need a brake. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe and to keep this thing cheap.